Hello there, David A. Rogers here, and I've got another tip for you inside of Photoshop, and it's to do with the pen tool. If you've used the pen tool before, you'll know that it draws vector lines. If you just click once without dragging, then it'll draw a straight line between the two points. If you click and drag, it'll create a nice curved line. Click and drag, and a nice curved line appears. Okay, that's great. But the problem is, I don't know where the next curve is going to be. I cannot see it until I actually put the pen down on the canvas and then begin to draw. Again, I cannot see from this point to the next point where the curve is going to be or where the straight line is going to be. So I have to actually click it down onto the canvas before I see the curve. Well, there is a way around that, and it's a very cleverly hidden little gem Underneath the options for the pen tool, there is only one. It's called the rubber band, and I'll check that. This is what it does. As soon as I click, I am now attached via this rubber band to the pen tool. If I click again, there's another rubber band. Click and drag. Now here's the most important thing. I can see where the curve is going to be, which makes it a whole lot easier, especially when you're learning to use the pen tool, to see where this path is going to go before I actually put the pen tool down on the canvas. Click and drag and I can see the curve coming off. That is the rubber band doing its job. So next time you're using the pen tool and you want to see where your curve line is going to be or where your vector line is going to be, don't forget this little hidden gem up here. It's the only one available to you. It's called the rubber band.